I am very sorry, Baba Mobat. Please forgive me for exposing you and for revealing secrets between us to the public. I hope you find it in your heart to forgive me. Talo Sobe, Baba's boldest blogger, Kuki Jesse, has finally taken a 360 degrees turn to apologize because honestly, it shocked people. Mm. It shocked people when, you know, about, it's about five days or six days ago now. She did her videos because she's always coming out almost on a daily basis to do videos. And trust is just like every platform on social media. It's been talks of, you know, um, justice for more bad. Either you're on the side of Umi or you're on the side of Baba or you're neutral. So it's a discussion in the public domain and everyone has the right to use their platform to talk about it and take on any perfect um, perspective they choose to take. Buki Jesse has always taken, well, when she started, she wasn't all about Baba. In fact, she was giving Baba buzz to an extent. But all of a sudden, you know, as she said, she gives whoever she has even given buzz an opportunity for them to come and express themselves. And this Baba did, and, you know, that was when she started taking on the mantle of Baba's blogger. And, you know, the shock of all the revelations she made. If you do watch a video, trust me, there are not videos of 10 minutes, 20, 30, 40. There are sometimes videos of 1 hour, 1 hour, 30 minutes, 2 hours, 3 hours sometimes. You know, where she gives back to back to back to back to back. You know, and if you really want to make um, a, a informed decision about what she's talking about, you have to listen well. Because she reveals the whole lot. She's very exp expressive. She doesn't seem to hold anything back. And so on the day that she decided to drag Baba Mubad like generator, oh my God, the dragging was horrible. It was not nice at all. In fact, people were dropping in the comment section to say, Madam, is everything okay? Madam, you're revealing too much. Madam, this is going to be a dent on Baba Mubad's image because... You're saying things and you're giving dates and you're giving figures. So we know you are a spokesperson. But she was really upset and she was saying it that nobody should stop her from talking. That she wants to say her truth. And when somebody has told you that she wants to say her truth, then you let the person be. So she didn't stop. In fact, not just that day. The second day as well, she came out again and gave Baba's bas 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 Even talking about 700k Orioke money that she sends from the UK and um, got a custodian for Baba, who is she tags her sister, to take Baba to an Oreo K and also lodge him in a very comfortable hotel of about thirty or forty thousand naira per night, and to take care of his feeding and everything. And that uh, when they were at the Oreo K, in mm, the the other side, we we'll leave that for another video. So of course she was talking from the point that you it can be seen that she's spending her money. And it's not as if she's making any money from it. To be realistic, from what we can see so far from on her side, she's the one spending money. For her to have sent 700k for about to be taken to Ryuki, it's not rice and beans. Nobody says she not get her own family members where she go give money to or help their financial situation. But she decided to be kind. So she gets her only, only thing about showing by me. Eh, Kasiko, okay, Obama, I don't understand that you're about to that point. Obama, so she had mouth in the matter because she wasn't making money from the whole thing. And she claims that her videos are not monetized. And I'm kidding you, Ole. If you check somebody's platform, you'll be able to know if the person is monetized or not. So that's our own taking, just in summary. However, two days after that, she decided to come out and say, Baba, Baba Mubad, I am sorry. Forgive me. I lost my temper. I was disgruntled. I was upset. I was frustrated. This and this and this. So why did Buki Jesse get to this point? In that same video of us, she said it. She said, after doing the bass goes for the first day and second day, that phone was almost blowing up. Calls, text messages, DMs, everything. People were just trying to reach out to her to be like, Madam Kilo Shele, Te Fogba, Yon Gombay, Kilo Day. In fact, there were so many things that we can't take in just one video that she said. 
And one thing is we are all gifted differently. While some of us will say everything we intend to say, some people are more emotionally intelligent. That when you have issues with them or when you fall out with them, they will talk about that thing or just announce that it's a fallout. But they will never go into details. They will keep you guessing. And those are the people that are wise enough to leave room. But when you and somebody is fighting, you're calling the person's kama. Like she called Baba Munjawa's kama. She called him greedy. She called him alatenuje. She called him uloju kokoro. She also mentioned that it's after his son's property. She called him stubborn. Hmm. For those of you in doubt, before you drop any comments here that you cannot defend, go and watch the video. It's all over the internet and on our page. So, it was quite, in fact, we're like, even if there's going to be a fallout, we didn't expect it to be this messy. You know, not ah ah, bobo, bobo, not just it, if you know, and all of that. It was quite much. But hey, she has decided to realize her mistake, and that's why she apologized to say, when she did the Gbazbo's first and second day and she got to work, according to her, that her colleague was asking her, ah, what's going on with you? You look a bit uh, down and everything. And she was like, she didn't like how she lost her cool like that. It happens to a lot of Bambinu. Nobody can calm them down. They will now come back to their senses to be like, ah, yes, I was upset, but I said too much. That even the too much now will now almost override the reason for my being upset in the first place. She said when the call was put through to her and someone was telling her that, ah, Nkothe she yi baba ti skata o. O ti affect mental health to baba. O ti jeki baba wa depressed. Ah, we. Boom, she saw jini ye kwe. He? Ah, um, o think e lo ben yara rara. Um, o fen koto ma yeki baba wa depressed o. Ah, so, ah, um, wa sorry gong. That that was the height or the point of realization she got to. And that is what has made her come out to do the apology. So this is done in order to... But trust the point that it's it because we reported it here of a outburst and we have to report it of how um, she has decided to apologize to Baba so that things peace will reign. She even said it that Baba me so can trust me more. Me then can confide me no me more. Because I know this is going to cause a strain in our relationship. But I'm just sorry. You know, which is okay, you know. I want to know nja, what the inquiry. However, to buttress the point why it took a while before I did this response of hers is when Baba went on two different occasions videos yesterday um to grant interviews, when he was mentioning that Baba Fala no Amumi are threatening him and he can't he doesn't feel safe in his house anymore, and that he's now looking for money. Baba she saw near Mwa what in my figure me. And that was where people hit Baba very well yesterday. They say, Baba, any at all, oh, oh, effect ballet, effect buffet, any do, oh, any donation, always, always, always. Eh? On my TOT wallet, that's it, bo, 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 anyway. So, um, Baba now said, his account details are shared already. Or it's shared, I think it's the Access Bank he mentioned, that is on Bilky JC's platform. So that gave that ray of. They are working on that, their relationship, presumably. So, now there we did now. So, we would, after the apology, Buki JC, of course, has done videos, about two or three after that, because she does on a daily, where she still hits hard on Mumi and claiming that it is Mumi that is behind every, the pie of Mubad. What's your opinion on this? Like we always say on this platform, Emma Shekpeni Biyo. Emma shekwe from Buki J the blog and bio. Emma shekwe from Baba Mubad in bio. Emma shekwe from Liam in bio. Emma shekwe from Yam Mubad in bio. Bio and she be a lake. A lot see your platform to change shekwe. Kellogg presidential chair, Sibe, came from Azorok Villa, Sibe, Awaki, shekwe, and be there by shekwe, and be a mad time, see, by one million for any no don't to Tony. To recall the queen of video. O look at the world social media. Adele disagree, Lorraine call. I share different perspective. Lori Inkon. Should not enter by a book with Danny. A big pain loss with Dottima accommodates on the matter tolerating. I walk his shape when he be. And he shall brew. 
odun tutu lawa e je ka fopo lo ma construct ka lo pa ma lo ko everybody tori comment elomi olo ma je ko lo taste kirikiri ninu nkan ta n ba lo e ire o